is it with US Republicans and being ashamed of who they are? And the gay male Republicans, they're not just in the closet, they're out in the street swinging bats saying, hey, let's go beat some of them gay bastards, and when no one's looking, uh, trying to suck some dick. I don't get that sort of ridiculousness. If you're gay, you're gay. Deal with it. And they come up with such crap excuses. The guy got caught recently soliciting from an undercover cop. His excuse was, oh, I was in a park and there's this bunch of black dudes and black dudes make me nervous so I offered to suck the guy's dick. Hey, that's completely normal behaviour. Yeah, if you're nervous, um, start offering to suck dick. I'm never going in a haunted house with that guy. I'll tell you that much. And the latest to get busted is Senator Craig, who admitted under interrogation that, yes, he was soliciting some sex from an undercover cop, but now he's saying, oh, maybe I won't resign. Maybe I can back away from saying I did it. Hey, those cops made me nervous, so I confessed. Hey, one Republican sucks dick when he's nervous, another one confesses to sucking dick when he's nervous. This is some strange reactions to nervousness. So it actually seems like, if you want to know what the particular perversion of a Republican is, just look at what they speak out against. That's what they do, apparently. Uh, someone speaks out against internet predators, and he's sending kinky text messages to teenagers who work in his office. Someone speaks out against Bill Clinton's adultery. He's going to hookers. Someone wants homosexual marriage banned. They're getting casual sex in public toilets. Which brings me to possibly the biggest freak in the Republican Party. And that's saying something. Senator Rick Santorum. Look up Santorum on a search engine. It's really cool what he's been immortalised for. Good for a laugh. Like most Republicans, he's gone on the record as opposing gay marriage. But he's taken it a little further than that. He's a bit of a freak. In one interview, when a reporter was saying... Why does it bother you if gay people are allowed to get married? Santorum goes off on this spiel where he says, like, allowing man-on-man -man sex, it just goes straight on to man-on-dog sex. And the reporter was mildly stung. There had been no discussion of bestiality up to that point. Santorum just, off his own bat, wants to start denouncing man-on-dog sex. That's all the evidence I need. That dude... Fucks animals.